In today's video, I'll show you how to fix the no audio device installed or no audio device found issue on Windows 10 and Windows 11. Right now, I'm on Windows 11, and as you can see, when I hover over the sound icon in the bottom right corner, it says no audio device installed. Clicking on it reveals that the volume slider is disabled and all audio is muted because the system isn't detecting any sound devices. But don't worry, I've got the solution for you. The first step to fixing this issue is to open the Windows Services menu. Click on the Windows Start button and Search Services. Open the Services window. On your keyboard, press W to search and locate Windows Audio option. Double click on Windows Audio and ensure that the startup type is set to automatic. The server status is running. If the status is stopped, click on start, then click apply and OK to save the changes. Additionally, you can check Realtek Audio Service. Press R on your keyboard for shortcut. If you see a service named Realtek Audio, double click on and ensure that it is also running. And if it is disabled, then make sure to start the service, then apply and click OK to save the changes. Once these steps are completed, the issue should be resolved. As you can see, my audio is now working again. This is a quick and effective fix you can apply right away. If the previous fix doesn't work, the next step is to update your audio drivers and windows. Here's how. Right click the windows icon and select settings. In the left hand menu, click windows update. Then choose advanced options. Then click on Optional Updates. Click on Driver Updates. Look for any audio related updates, such as Realtek. Then click Download and Install. It's also a good idea to update your entire operating system. Once updated, restart your computer and check if the issue is resolved. If the problem persists, follow these steps to check update and reinstall your audio drivers using Device Manager. Right click on the Windows icon and select Device Manager. At the top, expand audio inputs and outputs. Locate your speaker or audio device, for example Realtek High Definition Audio or any other audio speaker. Right click on it and check if it is disabled. If so, select Enable Device. Right now it is not disabled, so it is not showing Enable option there. Next choose Update Driver, and sometimes new updates solve the issues. Select Search automatically for drivers and install any available updates. Next, scroll down and expand Sound, Video and Game Controllers. Look for High Definition Audio Device or any related audio service. Right click on it and ensure it's not disabled. If needed, select Enable Device. Click Update Driver, then choose Search Automatically for Drivers. Click Close once the update is complete. If none of the previous methods resolve the issue, follow these steps to check and configure your sound settings properly. Right click on Windows Star button, select Settings, then go to System. From the left hand menu, click on Sound. Scroll down and click on More Sound Settings. This will open a new window. In the playback tab, locate your speaker or audio device. Ensure that the correct speaker or audio output is set as the default device. Right click on your preferred speaker. Select set as default device. If it's not already set, then adjust volume levels. Select properties. Go to the levels tab. Ensure the volume is set above 50%. If it's at zero, you won't hear any sound. Next, in the Advanced tab, you can test the sound by clicking the green arrow test button. If you hear the sound, it means your audio is functioning properly. If you've tried all the solutions and still experiencing the issue, the final step is to power flash your computer. This is one of the most effective solutions and can help resolve persistent audio problems. For desktop users, shut down your computer completely. Unplug all power cables and disconnect any external devices such as USB drives, keyboards, mice or other peripherals. Press and hold the power button for 25 seconds to discharge any residual power. Reconnect the power cables and peripherals, then turn your computer back on. Check if your audio is now working correctly. For laptop users, if your laptop has a removable battery, 
Remove it along with the charging cable and all external devices. Press and hold the power button for 25 seconds to release any stored power. Reconnect the battery, charger and peripherals, then turn on the laptop. Check if the issue is resolved. That's it guys. These are the most effective solutions to fix the audio problem issue on Windows 10 and Windows 11. If this video helped you, don't forget to hit the like button and let me know in the comments which method worked for you. See you in the next video.